All right, guys, what are we talking about this time? I have a little Camillus flipper on bearings and a cheap Kershaw from a Walmart Christmas pack. This was given to me by someone who bought it just to check it out. And this came out of a Christmas pack that was marked down to $5 this past Christmas. And I picked it up for just to have the extra bits and bit drivers just to throw in my bag along with some of my other ones. So I figured I'd go ahead and break this one out to test. It is 3CR13. And this one is, it's just marked 440. And I believe this was under $15. And my guess would be it is 440A. I know Camillus uses quite a bit of that. So let's go ahead and watch the cutting real quick. It's going to be quick. And come back and talk about how these did. I'm going to go ahead and start out with the Kershaw. It's your basic, inexpensive Kershaw FRN type plastic scales, assisted opening, 3CR, nothing special. This was new, I had never used it, never did anything with it. So I went ahead and sharpened it, dulled it on a stone, repeated that three times so I could just go ahead and test it right away. On this 3CR from Kershaw, on the first test, I got 13 feet fine edge, 12 feet working edge, for a grand total of 25 feet of cutting in a one inch section. Yes, that's pretty bad. So I went ahead and sharpened it again, ran the test again for verification. On that test, 13 feet fine edge, 13 feet working edge for a total of 26 feet. Yes, in the past three, four years ago, I have had a couple of these come through my hands to try out 3CR Kershaw stuff. And yes, it all went e equally <laughs> went dull during use rather quickly. So for me, this isn't something that I can really use. 25 26 feet total cutting and this edge up here is only about I don't even think it's an inch and a quarter of a cutting edge this section right here that would not get me through breaking down recycles at my house that I do a couple times a week so just to give you an idea that's this is low Onto the Camillus, this also plastic type scales, liner lock, it's hollow ground, it's fairly thin, it was also run at 15 degrees per side. And what it actually cut is what makes me think it is just regular 440A like they use quite a lot. 
especially knowing that the price point of this is under $15. This one still had the factory edge. It was dull, but it had it. Did the same as the Kershaw. Did three sharpenings right in a row. Sharpened it, dulled it on a stone. Repeat three times. Get it ready to test. So, the 440A Camillus, the first test, 24 feet fine edge, 8 feet working edge for a total of 32 feet. Sharpened it again, ran the verification. On that test, 25 feet fine edge, 9 feet working edge for a total of 34 feet. So, also not great, but when you compare it to what the Kershaw did, just the fine edge on this is about what the total working edge on that 3CR is. No, I don't think this one is great either. This, same as the other one, this, I just have too many things to cut each day. This would not, not get it done for me does have a pretty good detent is on bearings the grind isn't bad at all it would be curious to run this against a rough rider as soon as I can find mine I will go ahead and test that 440A also, although I don't expect it to do much better than this one did. But just so you guys have an idea of what these two are capable of, 3CR, 440A, it's part of the budget series. I do have one more video like this coming out with some 3CR, 5CR, 7CR steals like that 440c to show what they will do i'll compare these to those when i go ahead and do them that's all i have for this one as always i appreciate your time and thanks for watching